Let's see how to fix Camtasia audio stream not supported audio error something in that regard. So let's say I drag in one of these videos and instantly you can see the error invalid or unsupported audio stream. Now you can fix this using Audacity. You can also fix this using VLC. You can also use Handbrake to fix this, but Audacity is the easiest and that's the one I'm going to show you how to do. So first of all, install Audacity if you don't have it installed. And then even before you open Audacity, go to Google and you need to install the FFmpeg codec for Audacity. Just do FFmpeg, FFmpeg Audacity, enter. You're going to see this on the Audacity documentation, installing FFmpeg. So you need to install this before Audacity can read and extract audio from your video. So if you scroll down, you're going to see, you can install it for Windows. There's a link for installing it for Windows, Mac, and Linux. So of course, with Camtasia, you're probably, you're probably on Windows or Mac. So choose your platform. In this case, I'm on Windows. So I'm going to choose this link. And on this page, you can download it for your Audacity. So if your Audacity version is below this, make sure you upgrade because the other versions, installing them, you probably won't make it work instantly. So just upgrade your Audacity version and then download the version for your Audacity. If you're running 64-bit Audacity or 32-bit Audacity, you can install the right version. So once you click there, FFmpeg Audacity, you can download it and install it. Okay, you can see it's an exe file. Download and just run it. And once you run it, you can start up Audacity. And if Audacity was running, close it and restart it. In this case, I'm just going to start my Audacity because I already have FFmpeg installed. For the video that I was getting the error, I can simply just drag the video in there, drag and drop the video into Audacity, and Audacity is going to extract the audio from that video. If you need to edit the audio, go ahead and edit the audio as much as you need to on Audacity, and then finally export. And then finally export the audio. To export it, just do Control Shift E, or you can just come here under file and click on what I've clicked on, and then choose where you want to place the audio. The supported formats are there, but you can just go with the WAV format, use the WAV format, and use the settings that I'm using here because these are not going to give you any problem on Camtasia. You can use them. So let's assume that I export this. So I can close that error, close the error. And then here, I'm also going to separate audio and video and then close the error once again. And then I'm going to delete this audio. And now I can bring in my audio that's working fine. So I'm just going to drag it in there and your audio problems are now fixed. Another alternative is to convert the video. You can convert the video using VLC or Handbrake. If you have many videos to convert, you can use Handbrake to do a batch conversion, but that takes a lot of time. Just use Audacity to extract the audio like I've shown you. Most importantly, you have to install FFmpeg for Audacity. Without this, you won't be able to extract the audio from your video. All right, that's it for this one. If you have any questions, feel free to let me know. Mm -hmm.